A pedestrian was hit and killed by a car while crossing Trinity Lane. The victim was outside the crosswalk. News Channel 5's Jesse Knutson is with us live. And Jesse, this is a story that's just be become all too familiar. It is, Rory. 47-year-old William Smith was trying to cross East Trinity Lane when one car yielded for him. He was not in the crosswalk, so another car went around that car, unfortunately hit and killed Smith. Now, it's an extremely sad situation, but one that is becoming more common here in the mid-state. Standing in the middle of the road, surrounded by thousands of pounds of steel and aluminum traveling at high speeds, is not the ideal place to be. But in East Nashville and many other parts of town, crossing the street amid traffic is a common sight. Nobody really watches out for you out there. A lot of crazy drivers, a lot of people pulling out in front of each other. It's like a deadly game of Frogger. The fact that the traffic is so relentless, people just kind of find their chance to cross the street whenever they can. Unfortunately, many people have been killed trying to cross Nashville streets. And while sometimes it's the driver's fault, other times the pedestrian has a role to play, putting themselves at danger. They will be crossing the street and I won't see them because they're wearing dark clothing. Crystal and Andrew Noble bring their dog down to Shelby Bottoms for walks rather than risking being hit by a car on Nashville's busy streets. And even state employees walking to work where there are obvious pedestrian crossing signs encounter trouble. I've had very close calls. In the past two years, John Warkerton says he's almost been hit by cars about 10 times while walking in clearly marked crosswalks. I, I assume they're not going to stop. I have to. John believes if more people paid attention and avoided distractions, a lot of these problems could disappear. So both pedestrians and uh, drivers need to be careful, vigilant, and hopefully follow the law. As for the Noble family, they think if everyone was a little more considerate on the roadways, Nashville would be a better and safer place. It all boils down to people caring about each other yeah. and being conscious and watching out for one another. Definitely something to be cognizant of. Now at this time, it's unclear if any charges will be filed against the driver in that fatal accident last night. Live in Nashville, Jesse Knutson, News Channel 5.